Hey there. So, I finally convinced my father to let me build him a new PC to replace the aging off-the-shelf unit he currently has. And it took that machine nearly dying to do that. So today, I'll be building a high-powered desktop workstation for him, and compared to the nearly 10-year-old AMD A6 5400K he's currently working with, this PC will be capable of doing everything he wants to do for the foreseeable future. He wants to run a quad monitor setup for his trading while streaming from multiple sources, and this rig will do that all day without breaking a sweat. And it will be near silent while it works. Since I know you're only here for the tech porn, let's get to it. For this build, silence is important. So I've decided on this Be Quiet Pure Base 600 without a windowed side panel. In exchange for the flashy visibility, we are getting a case with sound dampening insulation on all panels. It also comes with one 120mm and one 140mm Pure Wings 2 fans. Because we do lose some airflow in a case designed for silence, I'm also adding two more 140mm Pure Wings 2 fans, which each move an impressive 61 CFM while staying around 18 decibels. In order to provide him with all the processor power he could want while not breaking the bank, I've decided to use this Ryzen 7 1700, which we know should have no problem overclocking to 3.7 GHz on all cores. Just as an extra measure, I'll be using this CryoRig M9A 120W TDP cooler to help keep those temps in check once it is overclocked. That chip will be set in an ASRock Pro 4 AB350 ATX motherboard, again to mitigate cost thanks to our prior knowledge that for other than extreme overclocking, that should be all the motherboard needed. For system memory, I have this 16 gig set of 3200 MHz CAS14 Flare X RAM to provide high-end performance with no compatibility issues. For super fast boots, I'll be using the Corsair MP500 240 gig NVMe SSD. If you're curious as to how they perform, you can check out those results here. For mass storage, I have this 2TB Seagate Fire CUDA SSHD hybrid mechanical drive so he can quickly load his data spreadsheets and have plenty of storage for his projects. Because he would like to run a quads monitor setup, I went with this EVGA GTX 1060 3GB GPU so that he has all the power he might need in that regard for the foreseeable future. I've also added this LG Blu-ray rewriter, this Rosewill 40-in-1 card reader, and this Blackmagic Design Intensity Pro 4K capture card so that he can capture and convert all of the family videos going back decades to a modern format he can share with everyone. This will all be powered by this Corsair CX550 power supply. So, let's get on to the build.
And here we are with the complete dad build. No flashy lighting, no fancy bling, near silent running. The biggest request made of this build was that it be the last PC he ever needs to buy. Now keeping in mind that the man is pushing 70 now, that is most likely to be the case. He will be able to capture from nearly any media in existence at the consumer level, analog or digital. He'll be able to run his dream quad monitor setup for his day trading, stream his news sources, and do all the video editing he could desire without this machine ever having a problem. He could even do some significant gaming if he so desired. If you're interested uh, in how the rig performs, I'll put links in the description below to the FutureMark and UserBench benchmark results. As always, go ahead and click that subscribe button and notification bell. And if you like this video, give it a like. If you didn't, well, I'm sorry you never got over that heartbreak. I'm Meat Popsicle from the Prodigal PC, and I shall speak to you when I return. Oh,